Hello everybody, how's it going and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. We're here today playing some more Brotherhood and I'm knocking things all over the place. Right, so when we left off we had just assassinated the banker. No, hold on, no, the Baron de Valois, because uh, he's dead. Um, and now we want to train up our assassins because someone commented like, you need to train up your assassins, they're shit. And I know they're shit, I just haven't got around to talking to the nice pigeon man. So, I'm gonna now. It's like the, the woman from, uh, what was it from? Uh, Home Alone 2. The, the one with all the pigeons. Uh, right, uh, we'll do this one because uh, we've only got one assassin. Ah, and he's fucking shit. Right, um, Assault a Spy. I'm sure you can pull that off. What was his name? What was his name? Lorenzo La Falce. Okay, right, we need to go get more assassins because we have one because they all fucking died because they're useless. So, how much medicine do we have? So, fuck, it'll do. Did I say we couldn't carry enough medicine and we need to get more? And then I never actually got any more? Or have I just managed to run out to the point where it looks pretty realistic? Um, let's grab some medicine. Because we need some medicine, don't we, really? Let's be fair. Okay. Oh, fuck. I just... My mic just... I just um, gave, gave a bit of a spasm. Um, right. Uh, we'll get... We'll sell things. The Cardinal's purple dye. I don't think we're going to need that. Or the elephant ivory, or the inner diamond, or the valley impaler coin, or the wool. Uh, yes, that was a, a bit aggressive. No, hang on, we never bought the, the medicine pouch. What? For Christ's sake, I thought we bought it. No, I'm, I'm almost certain we bought it. Uh, let's just go check out uh, Banker. Mr. Banker Man. Oh, we do have some money. We do have some money. Okay, not much, but we do have some. Um, I think what we ought to do, maybe in this episode, is maybe go around and do some renovations kind of thing. Because... I don't, I don't, you know, it, I don't think we're getting anywhere with the renovation. So, we're going to go ahead and do a bit of renovating. Um, uh, pouches, I think we want some pouches. Um, and we will grab this one. So, medium medicine pouch and... Okay, we're all good, I think. I think we're all good. So, I think what we all do in this episode is... Sorry, I'm just sorting out my ear, my earphones. Give me a minute. I'm just explaining things, though, so it doesn't really matter. Um, in this episode, I think we ought to go and maybe do a couple of the Borgia Towers since they kind of, like, liberate the area kind of thing. Um, and then, yeah, do a bit of renovating because we literally have done, like, no renovations. So, it might be a good idea. Unless we go around and just renovate what we haven't already renovated. So, like, if we just go around... Because it'll just, it'll just increase our income kind of thing and it'll just be useful to kind of have done... Um, because then we just get more money, and then we can get more upgrades, Fetzio, and everything, everything will be great. Um, anyways, I wish I had, like, a channel this size when Assassin's Creed Brotherhood came out, or even when Assassin's Creed 2 came out, that'd be great, because then I could, like, share the game and my first impressions with people who, who actually gave a shit, because I made my channel 2011, so it was when Brotherhood had just come out, like, the previous year, and I was waiting for Revelations, that's kind of what my channel was based off of, is kind of, like, the waiting for revelations, and only no one really cared, because I only got like 100 subscribers in my first year, but that's fine. So did Ali A. It was his third year when he started, his channel started to pick up, uh, and that hasn't happened for me. But that's fine, you know, I mean, in the terms of gaining like a million subscribers, but, you know, it's done the best. Uh, I think, what have I done? I got, I get, right, this is going to sound odd, because I explained it the other day to Elva, and it did sound a bit odd in my head, and I thought I might have got it wrong, so I did the math like three times, but... I um, have gained 700% of my subscribers uh, in 2000. In the, the subscribers that I had in 2013, I gained 700% of that in 2014. So that's my math, and this is loud. Oh, yep, yep. Okay, right, yep. We're gonna turn that down because that's fucking loud. Um, we'll speak to you because hello. And then we'll also turn down the sound on my Elgato, because I feel like you guys are suffering from that. Um, so, yeah. That was well done. Please, teach me to fight them as you do. No, fuck off. Right, um... Oh, look, all the swords are on the ground. We have the old Syrian saber. Um... Oh, we're going to renovate... Okay, we're going to do renovations. We. Oh, shit, I'm sorry! I almost killed you. Be glad I didn't. Run away! Okay, um, where is the... El oh, we've already done it. I was going to call it the Elgato then, and I just... Uh, I sh 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 Let's go and grab the horse stables, because everyone loves a good horse. And, um... Uh, yeah, y yeah. Um, okay. 
Does anyone? I'm uh, just wondering. Uh, like, does do people want me to carry on with the free roam open world series, like for Unity and Rogue? Because I don't know. I haven't felt like doing it, and I feel like do people miss it? Because no one's really asked for it, so I don't know. I've just kind of been like, well, I I, I can leave it, but you know, whatever. Um, something I can't wait for is No Man's Sky. How many of you guys want to see a little let's play of that? Like, kind of like a it'll kind of be like a Minecraft series since it is quite sandbox. Uh, so we just kind of free roam around for like. 20 25 minutes every episode and it could go on for like hundreds of episodes of me just playing that loads uh, Obviously it wouldn't interfere with any of the AC stuff any of the AC news any of the let's plays It'd just kind of be there in the background. and I'd do it a lot, but it'd be it'd be great fun Honestly, I can't cannot wait for that game. I think that'd be so much fun and uh, yeah, it'd be it'd be good Um, we have we have a lot of notoriety. What has happened here? Have you been talking mr. Nobleman? No! You've been telling people about my... Oh, shit. I didn't mean to know. There we go. That's what you get. Oh, shit. I threw him in a... He's safe. Oh, he's confrontating a horse. Right. We'll just continue with whatever we were doing. Uh... I was just going to go grab this because we do have a lot of notes right, actually. Oh, something. 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 Uh, Armour. We want armour. More armour. Someone also commented that. Get more armour because we have been lacking in the armor area um so i don't see right what they should do is they should have all three of the notoriety things on the map at all times like so even if you have like like the tiniest bit of notoriety you should still be able to pay the heralds because i don't understand like it just you should still be able to pay heralds so low you know to right there we go we just got some in the bank vault um what else do we have uh if we find a blacksmith to renovate, we can go renovate the blacksmith, and then we'll do the one by the Pantheon. Uh, we can renovate the blacksmith, and then buy from the blacksmith. And that's a good idea. I don't think I've ever been in this area of the map before. This is weird. Um, okay. There's probably, like, one building that you just haven't climbed in the whole of Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Like, there's gotta be, like, one that I've just never been on before, but I wouldn't even notice because it all looks exactly the fucking same, but that's not the point. You know, I it, it could be, it could be a thing. It could be. Um, I don't actually care. Whatever. Right on the other side of the pantheon is justice. It's not really, but um, we're gonna go there anyway because there might be something else that's cool. Uh, the blacksmith, actually, that's the point. That's why we go. Oh god! Wow, that was a lucky save, Ezio. You're a, you're a pro. You're a pro at this, mate. Um, whee! Right, so we want to. Hmm. I started off Assassin's Creed 2 with the whole kind of let's play, just do what we want kind of thing, and then, end oh shit, I'm sorry, woman. Um, and then we kind of went on to the whole just get through the story, uh, and I started this with the whole get through the story, and now I'm going through the, like, free roam, because I've realised that I don't actually have enough money to do anything. Um, but it's fine. Right, come here, blacksmith. You better give me an extra 945 per hour, That's because that's how much I paid for you, so... I don't know what what it what, what it added on. It definitely wasn't 900, whatever that was. So, um, repair all of our armor, armor, chest guard, Roman greaves. No, uh, r wait. R why did I read that as Roman greaves? Uh, rondel, rondel, plate, 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 pauldrons. That's so worth it. Let's get the plate pauldrons. This was this was the wrong idea. Um. Okay, so this was dumb, but who cares? Uh, crossbow bolts. Could not have enough to even buy the... Wow, okay. At least we're going to look fucking cool. Like... Oh, wait, let's be honest. There we go. Look how good we look. We look pro. Um, although we don't have enough flowers to do anything else, so we might as well go do the main quest. It's really, like... There's not really much point in just sitting around. Although, we could go and do the Borgia Towers. Or the Romulus Tombs. People have asked me to do the Romulus Tombs, and I was like, I don't want to. But I might. Because. You know what? Comment and let me know. Who wants to see a lot of the Romulus tubes? But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the layer of. Um, the layer of Borgia. Uh, yeah, let me know if you want me to do the, la the layer of Romulus. Who, however many people say, go for it, oh, then I'll do it. Like, you know, just depending on how many people let me know. But, uh, yeah. Um, what I'm going to do is we're going to. Oh, fuck. We're going to. Um, you know what I should do? Is when I've finished each game, go back and do them all 100% for you guys to watch. Um, and, like, I can just add to the series and just call it, like, uh, Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, like, for next, like, uh, just do part 25 or whatever I ended on, I forgot. But then it'd be, like, um, um, I guess, 
finishing off, I'd call it. Assassin's Creed 2 finishing off, part 25. No, I'd have to call it part 25, and then in brackets, finishing off, wouldn't I? Um, I could do it with, like, part 24 ending in brackets, so then people know, like, yeah. But uh, if you, I could do that if you wanted me to. After I finished all of the Ezio trilogy, go back through them all and try and finish them all 100%, like, from wh whatever, wherever we kind of left off with the percentage. And I could always do that for you guys if you wanted me to. Uh, but yeah, let me know if you want me to do Romulus Tombs and stuff like that, and we can go ahead and we can do that. Uh, we might as well go to the bank, actually, because we did we did get some money in the bank. Like 3,000 or something, but it's not a point. Okay. 3,835, I think. Okay. Swamp malaria. I'm not suffering from that, and I don't want to be either, but... If you have a cure, I know where to go if I ever get it. Not the cure, the malaria, the swamp malaria. I don't know why I'd have swamp malaria in Rome though, because I don't. It's not exactly near a swamp. So, you know. Oh God. Okay, we made it. Okay, we want to go into the water tower. We will fight them in the tower, and that's it because it's the only location. Hang on, that's um the innkeeper voice, isn't it? I'm the innkeeper. Today, I'm letting you stay with me in the inn, because I'm an innkeeper, and I'm kind and generous, and also an innkeeper. What am I doing? Okay. We gotta go up. The only way is up. Is that a, What song is that? Like, what's... What it, I don't even know what that's from. Is it from something, or is it just like a song? And I've never heard it before in my life. People just randomly sing it, and it kind of just gets in your head. Although no one has actually sung it, sang it for a while. I don't think. Okay, it doesn't matter. What is he doing? Oh shit! There's a there's a man of death up there. Who the what? Oh, I thought it was a guard that saw me. I was like, no. Can we burn the tower down before we've killed the guy? Or Let it roll. So we take control. In California to my home sweet home. Uh, I don't know... Where we go? Uh, I think he's round here, actually. Like, kind of giving a speech thing, because you, you find those a lot of time. Um... Wow, that was completely unnecessary racing. Um, right. Okay. Uh... Oh, there he is. Do you reckon we could, like, insta-take him out if we had our crossbow? See, if we had the poison dart thing, then I could poison dart him, but I don't have the poison dart thing, so that's out of the fucking question. You there. Pay attention. I could have murdered you right now. Always be aware of your surroundings. Our strength comes through vigilance. Assassins will not. Come on, quick! Call, call the assassins! Call the assassins! Call the assassins! Shit! Got to chase him. I have experience with the assassins. I know them. Do what I do. Fuck! No! Shit! He escaped. Ah, uh, right. Let's do the fucking quest. Uh, I should have found a better way to take him out. That was that was pathetic. That was the worst attempt. Ugh. Right. Anyways, on to the quest. Main quest. Anyways. Um. Ah. Uh, nope. Nothing. Nothing is true. 
Everything is for me. See, they've got some. Uh, oh shit! Sorry, I knocked my mic again. I'm very. I apologise for that because I know how annoying that probably is. Okay, what do you guys think, by the way? Okay, of a trucker series, right? Where me and Luke on GTA 5 we're truckers and we have to do crazy things in our trucks. Like, you guys give us challenges and we've got to pull them off in the truck and do it like a different episode every time. And you guys basically recommend, like, do this in the truck, do this in the truck. Like, I don't know, try and drive to the top of Mount Chiliad without falling down or... I don't know, just, just random, random, like, stuff in the, like, to do with our trucks. That'll be really, really kind of funny and cool. And I can edit it down into a cool, nice little video. They're probably, like, 15 minutes long max. But it'd be quite of, kind of fun to do and we could do it every so often. It should be really, really cool. Like, a nice little cool series on GTA 5. Uh, next gen, of course, so we could do it in first person. That'd be really, really, really cool. We're thinking about yesterday, and I was, I wanted to put the, put the proposal towards you guys. Would you like to see GTA 5 videos, basically? I was getting ready to have a drink. We're going to investigate the knives. Buongiorno, Ezio. It is time to pay a visit to Lucrezia's lover, Pietro. I've sent my men out to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may. What is it? Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the castello. Machiavelli? Do you have proof? No. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The Borgia know the locations of our spies. Who told them? Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? See, it's not looking good for Machiavelli, is it? Let's be honest. I can understand La Volpe's concern. But he should listen to, you know, the, uh... El Mentore, or whatever they call Ezio. There he is, get him. This also trains up your assassins, doesn't it? Doing the whole calling him in during battle thing. Like if you call them in during battle, does that not then upgrade them as well? Like make, yeah, make their skill level better? I think it does, or I might be completely wrong, but uh... So sorry, fellow spy. I think it does upgrade them. I think it does, like level them up and stuff, I think. Well, I forget how else that works. It's in like another game where you, you have friends and if you allow them to just attack someone else, they just get leveled up a lot. And I might be wrong, actually. I'm not sure. Have you seen the game? Oh, my God. Have you seen the game Elite Dangerous? It looks insane. I am definitely going to buy I'm actually considering buying it. Um, it looks amazing. Go look it up. He is behind it all. He's not. Shut up, LaVolpe, you hooded bitch. Um, yeah, but if you want me to do some videos on Elite Dangerous, I would love to. It looks freaking sweet. Um, go look it up and then tell me. Be like, yeah, make videos on it. Because I'd love to. It looks amazing, honestly. Um, so that'd be super cool. Might start a little mini series on it. It kind of looks like No Man's Sky, only more realistic. And I don't think you can explore the planets kind of thing. But it looks really, really cool. Like, really, it's really realistic kind of thing. Like, it's kind of like a space simulator kind of thing. Looks pretty sweet, though. Where are we even going? Definitely going to be Let's Play No Man's Sky, though. It's... I don't think it's actually coming out on the Xbox One, so that's another reason to buy a PlayStation 4. It comes out for PC, but I'll probably get it on the PlayStation anyway, just because console gaming is my thing. I can't, I can't help it. I enjoy consoles more than PC. I said it. I said it. I've said it, but I'm still going to get a PC sometime soon. Not sure quite when, but... Within, like... January, I reckon. So yeah, can you guys, um, I, I want you to know, if any of you guys are PC experts out there, 
Um, a GTX 7, 7, 760. What is that like? Give me, give me an idea of how good the quality of that is. Like, if if there was an option between a 760 and I'll ask you in a minute. Pietro is to be assassinated this evening. Cesare sent his butcher. Yeah, if there was an option, right, between the 760 and the... Oh, was it 9-something? Shit. The best killer in Roma. No one escapes him. 970 or 960? One of the Come two. On. Would it be, a, like, would the 9 one be way better than the 760? Or would it be kind of, like, not that much better, like... Can the 760 run most games like on like ultra settings? Is basically what I'm saying. Like, would it be worth spending like a hundred and something more pounds on the on the 970? I think it was 970. Would that be better? Like, would that be a better idea? Would it be worth spending more money? Basically, is what I'm trying to say. Let me know. Comments. Thanks, guys. Rescue thief. Oh my Lavolpe. Couldn't obey the law. Um, we're getting way more attack than I thought we were gonna be. Um Oh god. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. Oh god. Come on, come here, you, you bugger. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh, what is going on? Any oh god! Oh, oh dear. Whoa, 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 what? God's sake. That's not fair. Not fair. We'll try again. Ah, okay. Okay. Let's go for the Volpe. Oh, shit, we already fucked it up. Okay. There we go. No, 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 let me do that. Shit, whoa! Look, was that really necessary, mate? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Yeah. Did you uncover information about Pietro? The man is an actor, and he is performed. Fuck that voice. Sorry? Was that really necessary to speak like that? Come on, Volpe. Let's go, mate. Well, there's no time to lose. We're on the road to nowhere. Even though we're going, we're going somewhere. Oh, by the way, Skyrim, I'm going to start that up again soon, by the way. So, you know, I swear I will. Definitely will start that up again soon. going we at the Coliseum Coliseum oh, I wanted to stop by the Coliseum maybe I, well, I wanted to watch a bit of a show but no nay I am a horse after all Richard the horse thanks for bloody what's his name Victor Marino for coming up with that because that's insane if you want to buy a Richard the horse t-shirt link in the description you should definitely check out my t-shirt store, actually, because I'm sure you'd freaking love them. Get your parent, like, nag your parents, buy one of my t-shirts, because they're, they're actually really cool. Um, Stephanie did the art for the Richard the Horse one. It looks beast, so, you know, it's really, really cool. If you have any other uh, t-shirt, like, things that you'd love to see on a t-shirt that relate to my channel that I could put on my spreadsheet, then go ahead and let me know, because then we could, then I could make them, and it'd be really cool. They hunted them, genius. What the fuck happened there? Oh god. 
Oh god. Oh god, things are not going right here. Okay, we're all good. Oh god, I hit a horse by accident. The Volpe's horse at that. Oh god. Oh god, things are... Oh god! This is going horribly wrong. Oh shit. I just want to be out of... Ah. Oh, hello. Okay. What did you find out about Pietro? He is to be suspended from a cross. Micheletto will come for him with a spear. Micheletto will come to hit, come for him with a spear. I'm not surprised. Um, right. How do we climb this, or do we have to upgrade the thing first before we can? Because I really want to do that viewpoint. It's really irritating me. Oh, we do have to upgrade. Nah, nah, nah. You break something, the idiot. The idiot. You're the idiot. Hello, Leonardo. Caprio. The French are pulling out of Roma. The Baron de Valois was found murdered within his own camp. Could it have been an assassin? There are rumors which favor such a theory. Never listen to gossip, Leonardo. It could get you into trouble. Good advice. <laughs> I've never seen that happen for double hill blades. There we go. I must return to my work. Yes, I love this Wait. bit. This lion Ezio's just sitting there for ages, and he has all this time to come up with this beautiful comeback of a line to Leonardo. It's beautiful. I can kill double the guards. I can kill double the guards. <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. It's just fucking hilarious. I can kill double the guards. It's like he's just sitting there for ages. And Leonardo just comes back. And that's all he has to say. It's like he's been thinking about it. It's not even like he has any hesitation. He was obviously sitting there thinking that one up, wasn't he? Thinking, oh, this is going to sound hilarious. Everyone's going to think I'm so so witty and stuff. And sound really cool. Oh, it's so ridiculous. No, 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 no. Knock him off. Don't knock him off. Oh, oh. He probably wouldn't have died, let's be honest. So that on a t-shirt, I could kill double the guards. Like a cartoon Ezio with like double hidden blades from Brotherhood. And then just like, I can kill double the guards. That'd be pretty cool, actually, on a t-shirt. I'd actually love that. Someone someone make that art for me. Anyways, jump down here. Yeah, I, I probably won't use it unless it's amazing. I'll, I'll probably just get Stephanie to make one for me. She did the Richard the Horse one. Whip that up. And it'd be pretty damn sweet. Desmond, you can't sync with this memory yet. Oh. Ezio seems to have done more with his recruits. What? Okay, Ezio seems to have done more with it. I've never, never heard that happen before. Oh, wait, look. Memories. Wait, I can't stick with this memory yet? Well, like, I can't do the main quest? Really? What? I didn't know that was a thing. Desmond, you can't sync with this memory. Fuck off, Rebecca! Right, um... Well, I guess we're going to end this one here. And then we can go ahead and... Yeah, so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure we got money. Smack that like button, because that'd be absolutely amazing. Comment down below your thought and subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye! And no wolves kept me tumbling down Raining fire from above Charge over the hills, but the city's had enough. But if we turn and fly, does it almost feel?